Hello, you extraordinary individuals. How are you today? I hope everybody is having a good start to their week. Um, so, I have a fairly good sized Timo haul for you here. Um, I have some canvases and I have an off canvas project and a little set. So we'll start with the set and the off canvas project and then we will move in order of size um, on through. So we have 20 by 20s, 20 by 30, a uh, couple of 30 by 30s, a um, couple of 40 by 40s, and a 40 by 60. So, yeah, you know, a little thing for everybody. All right. Let us begin. So, this actually represents two orders, you guys. Um, but they, they all came in together. They caught up with each other at customs. So, big surprise. <laughs> everybody managed to come through at the same time. Um... So, they all got here earlier today. Okay, so we'll start with this little pack. This was a pack um, of four canvases, and I'm not really sure what to expect, but you know, they were little, they were cute. They were little dragons, um, but the whole set was $5. So, and there are four of them. So each canvas is $1.25. So guys, I'm not expecting the Mona Lisa. Can we just say that? Obviously, this is not going to be like a premium company. So we will just have to mosey along. Um, so it came with standard boats, but it did come with two of them. So, you know, can't complain too much. That's one for each two canvases, right? Okay. So, this is the first one. Pretty cute. These are little 20 by 20s. There's 21 colors, which is pretty good for a 20 by 20. Um, nice clear drill field. I mean, you're not gonna have any trouble there. Um, one through eight is in fact one through eight. Nine through 21 is um, A through R, all capital letters. So yeah, those will be really easy to do. So that's the first one. You can see the thumbnail. Pretty cute. Then this one. Here's the thumbnail for this one. Pretty cute. I'm um, not sure about this one. Not sure the edges are defined enough, but they might be. We'll see how it comes out. And again, you know, 21 colors. In fact, they're all 21 colors. Yes, yes. Here's another one. I thought this one was really cute. I like it with his little wings out. <laughs> it's really cute. He's got great big eyes. And there's your thumbnail. And then last but not least, this one actually I think has the prettiest colors showing in it. So anyway, so there's your thumbnail. The little dragon with the wings and the tail. And there he is, cute as a bug's ear. So yeah, for $5, I am not upset with those canvases. I think those will be fun to do and that they will go very, very quickly. And I'm going to be glad. Imagine how cute these would all be if you, you know, put them in like the little frames from Dollar Tree that like are $1.25, the little plastic ones that I've shown you before on the channel. Or put them even in just, you know, little, you know, 8 by 8 or six by six frames and put them up you know in a collage in a baby's room i mean they would just be so cute so yeah so i'm happy with those and then here are the drills there's lots and lots of white because they are going to have background color because they are full drills even though they're 20 by 20. so yeah mm -hmm. yep there's some cute colors in there a lot of tans, a lot of grays, a lot of browns, got a got a lavender in there, got a red in there, got some peach tone in there. So yeah, I think those are going to be lots of fun. All right. Now, here is the off-campus project. 
Um, this one was right around, I want to say right around $6. However, I liked, well, here's the, here's the boat, standard boat. I really liked that there are six of these. These are bookmarks. That's what these little feathers are. Now, they're, they're very thin because, remember, bookmark. You don't want to break the spine of your book with something thick. And you only have to do one side. The other side is clear. But, you know what? Very easy to read. I don't think you're going to have any problem with that. I like this one. This has a lot of the rainbow pastel colors. Yeah, there's a green one. This one's got reds and pinks so with a little splash of yellow in there and some white. Here's purple and pink. And some more purples and some yellows. Now, they do come not only with the drills, but you also get little crystals to hang from the end of them after you diamond paint them. So that's nice too. Those are really pretty, really pretty. Sparkles a lot. Now, let's take a quick peek at the drills because isn't that the fun part of off canvas projects? I think so. All right. Let's see. Okay, so it'd be nice if I could get them in some kind of way that I can hold on to them and show you guys, huh? Okay, <laughs> so first one is a beautiful orange AB. Isn't that pretty? Boy, this, any leftovers of this are going to go in some of my Halloween canvases. Oh, yes, they are. I definitely think so. And then this has kind of a rose gold color to it, crystals. Ooh, pretty purple crystals. Um, actually, this is sort of that light purple. Here's the standard purple color. Wow, these are really pretty. <clears throat> these are like, um, like Aurora Borealis shine. Um, I think they're supposed to be clear crystals, but boy, are they pretty. And there's, ooh, a fuchsia color, which is my fave, one of my faves. Here's a little bit lighter pink color. Here's some standard black drills. Some yellow crystals. Oh, some really pretty aqua crystals. Beautiful. Some teal crystals. Some dark blue crystals. Some white iridescent half circles. Ooh, and some purple faceted half circles, which are beautiful. Gold half circles. Ooh, clear faceted marquees that are really pretty. Orange iridescent teardrops. And some blue faceted teardrops. Yeah, these are really pretty, you guys. I am going to enjoy doing this. Let me just tell you that right now. Yes, I am. So... Let's see, if I were to hit this up, how many sections would I need? Let's see. Eighteen. Not bad for off-campus projects, you know? So yeah, I would say this set is well worth it, especially since it does come not only with all the special drills, but these crystals are really pretty. I don't know if you guys have seen these. They're not as large, of course, as like the Suncatcher ones, um, like the, the angels or the butterflies that I've already gotten, or the dream catchers. But again, they're supposed to be for, here's all the, here's all your hardware, for uh, bookmarks. So yeah, but I mean, just, I mean, these are upside down. Look, but look how pretty. I mean, talk about sparkle. Wouldn't you love to have a bookmark with this hanging from it? Pretty. And it's a really pretty faceted teardrop shape that is just gorgeous. 
So yeah, you guys, I'm gonna have to say this kit's well worth it. So yeah, if you know anybody that still <laughs> still reads books or you know is a college student and has textbooks galore and they need a couple bookmarks, I'm gonna tell you this is the way to do it. So, and how fun is it to have something handmade by you, right? All your loved ones are gonna be like, oh, me, me. And then you're gonna go, God, I should have ordered two packages of them. Anyway, so, but you get my meaning. All right. So, run over and get you some of these feather bookmarks. Um, Timu is not the only place that has them. I have seen them um, at other diamond art companies. Um, I know that GBH, <laughs> <laughs> GBHKE has um, these or similar to these. Um, and I think Fancells has also a variety. So if you're not into Timo, you can check over there too. Okay, let's do the minis. And you guys, I'm telling you, I have huge whips going right now. I'm so thankful when I can find a little 20 by 20 or a 20 by 30 canvas because uh they can you know you feel like you can finish something unlike you know when you're working on one of these huge gargantuan monster canvases that take you forever to do i get so fed up with them <laughs> i have discovered though i mean this was the year of discovery for me i purposely because i've only been diamond painting well we're coming up on a year and a half but uh, i didn't do any um, events last year at all except drills and chills and that was late in the year but I'll tell you I have learned some things about myself and I'm glad I did and from now on I will not be doing a, any kind of event with bigger than a 40 by 50 canvas because otherwise I have no prayer of finishing it <laughs> for the event and you know which is fine I mean none of the events are put pressure or anything but I like to finish what I start so anyway Normal boat. And this one, I just liked it. I just liked it because it was a dream catcher. Yeah. And honestly, I don't know if that's supposed to be a sun or a moon behind it, but that's okay. It doesn't really matter. It's pretty. There's 15 colors. And it's supposed to be a stained glass effect. And I think when the drills are on here, it's going to be really, really pretty. Um, yeah, I really do think this is going to be nice when all is said and done because they really do i have a couple of 20 20 by 20s that i kitted up because i just needed something that i could finish so along with all these extra huge canvases so i mean they really are pretty once you get the drills going on them so here are two that i have going right now okay my little rainbow chihuahua. This corner is already finished. Okay, so you can see that when you get the drills on, they really do come up really cute. <laughs> and they're really cute to put in a frame and just have on your desk or on your table or a bookcase or, you know, whatever floats your boat. This one, I'm also doing this wolf. Same thing, I have this left-hand corner. I mean, sorry, right-hand corner done. Um, now, we read left to right, but I diamond paint right to left so that uh, my hand doesn't get in the sticky. I put the diamonds down, and then I can go over here to do this side, and I don't stick to the canvas. Anyway, but yeah, once you get the drills on, the picture comes alive. They're really cute. And these, you know, you don't have to worry about gifting because pretty much everybody can get a 6 by 6 square picture that, you know, they want to put somewhere. It's not like one of these huge canvases. Um, that you might find, you know, to, to do. And now you've got, you know, a, a 70 by 85 or 90 centimeter canvas. And you're like, gee, I'd like to gift that. But, uh, you know, I don't want to send people running into the street in fear. Okay, back to this one. So, these are the drills. Yeah, I can't see them real great. But I think you get the gist pretty much every color in here. There's pinks, reds, purples, yellows, blues, greens, a couple of oranges. So yeah, I think that will be a fun one. 
All right. Let's do let's do this one. Yeah. Okay. This one was just cute. I don't know. I just, I just liked her when I saw it. <sighs> This one is a little mermaid. And I thought she would be really fun. All these all these ocean colors to do. This one is really stubborn about straightening out, but we'll see what we can do. So yeah. Um, this one is 14 colors. I think they're going to be pretty colors that we're going to like because it's all sea creatures. And I love the blues and the aquas and the pink of her tail and her bathing suit and all of that. So, so yes, she's a real cutie, this one. She has a standard boat. And pretty much color scheme you would expect. We're doing things under the sea. Yeah. So yeah. I really think it's fun. If you find yourself feeling like you're burning out, get a small canvas. Now, small is relative. I mean, if small for you is 20 by 20, great. If small for you is 30 by 40, that's fine too. Get something smaller that you can make faster headway on just to kind of give yourself a little boost and a little refresher. Remind yourself you're doing a good job. All right. Are you ready for the first dragon? Are you? Because you knew that there were going to be dragons, so here we are. This one's a 20 by 25, which is interesting, because I don't think I have seen many 20 by 25s. I have some 20 by 30s. I have 20 by 20s. But I don't know. This was interesting that it decided to name itself a 20 by 25. Okay. Okay, let's see if we can give it a little incentive. All right, and there you go. This one also has 14 colors. You can see that there's the thumbnail. It's really cute. I <laughs> love this little dragon. Yes, I definitely do. And um, I love there's something sparkly at the end of his tail. And I like that he has this, this big old crest that goes way up here. So, yeah, really cute. Really pretty colors. I like this one a lot. Yeah, so that's what that other five centimeters does. It makes this rectangular instead of square. Now we know. That's the secret, guys. 20 by 25 is a rectangular canvas, and 20 by 20 is square. So see, we solved a, a mystery today. Look at that. I mean, telling you, that's what you get when you hang out with diamond painters. We figure that stuff out. We do. All right. So yes. And I think that this one was, I want to say 235. The others were, that I showed you were 211. So, you know, not bad for a quick little canvas. Look at these pretty colors. I love this pink and this purple. Yes, and there's a green and a blue behind that. There's a beautiful mauve color, some gray, some green, more blue. Yeah, he's going to be really cool to do too. So yes, but I have to tell you guys, this is the smallest piece of wax I've ever seen. Look, look. Literally, <laughs> I don't even think it's a full inch. It's like three quarters of an inch square. That's something else. Anyway. I don't know. Is there a run on wax all of a sudden that we don't know about? All right. <coughs> Let us move into the 40 by 40s. Now, I will tell you, I like the 40 by 40s. I think they're just a good size in general. But here's something that's, well, okay, here's a 40 by 40. Let's do the 30 by 30 and the 30 by 40 and then the 40 by 40. 
Let's have it in some semblance of sense. Maybe we'll do that. Okay. So, I just had a hankering because I happened to see Angela over at DP Creepy Cuties. She just finished a Medusa canvas for an event and I just thought it was the coolest thing ever. So I just wanted to just kind of run in there and get a Medusa for myself because you know what? How cool is she? 19 colors, 30 by 30. Yep, got one cool looking eye and one kind of not as cool looking, but you know, got snakes for hair. She's got some talons on her. There's some real nails here. But yeah, I thought she was just cool looking. And I thought, I definitely need to get this Medusa 30 by 30 canvas and have her around to do for something. I don't know what, but something. Because she is really cool looking. Now, Angela over at DP Creepy Cuties, she did a, a much larger one. I'm pretty sure hers was way bigger. Had more definition, but that's okay. I just liked it. So, and she was $3.98, which seemed appropriate. So yeah, for 19 colors, that's not bad. Typical boat. Nice color palette. A lot of beautiful colors in here. And I will bling out some of this area myself. I definitely will, especially her eyes. We gotta do that, and I'll probably put something. I'll probably use some of those um, gold electro drills that we got from our Diamond Art Club advent calendar in her nails, because they're supposed to be gold, and I think that would be cool, and make them shiny. All right, so that's Medusa, in case you're wondering. She's pretty cool, gotta tell you, you guys. Okay, this one, <laughs> I don't know, I just, uh, when I looked through my stash and I found out that I didn't have any witches, I went a little witch crazy, and I now have plenty of witches. So, I have my secret brew from Oraloa, I have swatches from Raven Diamond Art, and I have a couple now from our friends at Timo. So, yeah. <laughs> so, anyway, I, I did. I went a little bit witch crazy. But that's okay. Now I have plenty. And anytime I need one, I have one. So, yeah. There she is. Pretty cool. It even says witches. How about that? I know. Standard boat. Oh, really pretty colors too. Really pretty colors. So, some browns, greens, tans, red, beiges, pinks, yellows, more greens. Yeah, very pretty. There's some burgundies in there. There's a 310 in there. So yeah, but I think she's gonna be really fun. I liked that there were other colors that constituted the background and not just 310 because how frustrating would that have been, right? I know. So yeah, so she was really fun too. Little Miss Witch Lady. Whoops, sorry guys, didn't mean to thump ya. Okay, now this one, I also saw DP Creepy Cuties, Angela, do. Um, and I've seen it in a couple different places, but I don't know. I just liked it. I liked the colors. liked the expression. I just liked it. I bet Richard, Real Minecraft 2, probably has this in a huger, much huger size. Anyway, but I got it in a 40 by 40. And because I was in a, I was in a lightning flash sale this beautiful thing was free you guys yeah you heard me 
Maleficent free. But isn't she gorgeous? Oh, so beautiful. Now, there's still plenty of 310, okay? But there's lots of greens and aquas and pinks and reds and browns in her, in her crown. And she's got rings on and gold in her outfit. She's got a mirror down here. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh, I just loved it. I think this will be good for Halloween or Disney, really. So, whichever I end up doing first, I think this would be a great canvas because, oh, that's just gorgeous. I love her makeup. I'll tell you what. <laughs> Somebody does a good job on her. Maybe it's herself. I don't know. But, and I love this bird. Isn't this bird just a trip, this raven behind her? So cool. Really cool, you guys. Had to get Maleficent, especially for free. So awesome. Yeah. So, if you have an opportunity to get over to Timu, I'm going to tell you to do it because, man, oh man, you can see that some of that bright green in here already. Yep. And there's blues and pinks and reds and beiges, greens, mauves. Whoa, two more shades of green down here. Really cool. Yeah, you guys. Yeah, I'm sure all of these are our 310s, but anyway, yeah, run over there and get you a Maleficent because mm -hmm, she's awesome. Okay. Coming to the final two for this haul. Now, this is also a dragon. Yes, it is. But man, I saw this one. I just liked it, you guys. This is another 40 by 40. How beautiful is this dragon? Do you love this dragon and all the blue glory that it is? So pretty. I loved everything about it. I loved the color scheme. I liked the ornate um, curling around it. I mean, it's just really pretty. And I liked it. It was a 40 by 40. I don't know. It just suited me. So, yeah. There are 24 colors in this 40 by 40. Standard boat. Ta-da. Already kitted up drills in the nice little bags. Gotta love it, gotta love it. Yes, 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 indeed. Yeah, a lot of really pretty colors in there, you guys. So, yes. You yeah, get an opportunity. This dragon is just waiting over there for you to come get it. Mm -hmm. This one was not real expensive. I want to say five, five forty nine or five ninety eight. So, yep, it's over there. Now, some of these are probably going to be sold out because you know when you get this stuff on sale, there's usually not a whole lot of them left, which is sometimes why they're on sale. But, you know. Now this one, I just don't know how to feel about for sure. Um, this is actually one of my unicorns. This is off an Ann Stokes painting called The Guardian. Now you saw me get one of my unicorns a while back from Coo Deals in purple. That was Copperwing was the name of that one. This one is actually called The Guardian. However... I love it. I absolutely love it. However, there are words on here and I don't know, I don't know what the heck they say. I don't know what the heck they're supposed to say. Uh, and I'm, I'm hoping, I literally, I can't read them you guys and they're not in thumbnail. So I don't know what they are. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know what these are. 
Anyway, this is a 40 by 60. But yeah, see, there's, there's words up here. No idea. But I love this one. I love how the dragon's wings come down. Let's see if I can get you out here a little bit more. And kind of wrap down here. And then the lady is in the middle. And there's more words on the bottom. No idea what they mean. But anyway. So. But I loved the artwork. I've always loved this artwork. So anyway, I had to get it. There are 27 colors in this one. So yeah. Standard boat. And here's our drills. Well, it's a 310. At least these are in a regular train and not in those awful little tiny bags that make me crazy. So, <clears throat> yeah. I think there's going to be lots of really cool colors in here to try. But, yep, yeah, I love, love, love this artwork. And I think what I'll probably do <clears throat> is I will just put... Um, I think this background is largely 310. Yeah, yeah. So what I'll do is I'll just use the 310 and I just won't include the um, the wording because it doesn't need to be here and I have no idea what it means. And I'm interested in the picture. So I will just use 310s and blot it out so that you will not see it when it's together. But anyway, but I just, oh, loved it, loved it. Had to, had to get it and give it a try. Yep, so pretty. Here is the thumbnail, which is not fantastic to see, but anyway, there you go. So, yeah, there it is. I love the dragon's full head crust is all spread out, and he's all about himself, right? Yes, um, and I want to thank all of you, my new subs. Bless your cute little hearts. Thank you so much. I've made it to 500 subs, people. Woohoo! So, soon there is going to be uh, contest information, probably in a whip and chat video, where I'm going to tell you how we're going to do this. And um, if you do not want to participate uh, in the random drawing, you don't have to. I mean, you're going to get something sent to you from me. But um, again, you know, totally up to you. If you don't want to, you can let me know. Um, and if you, what I will do is I will let the people who do want to, they will have a, either a symbol or a word that's going to have to be in the comment section. And you'll probably have a good week to 10 days to do that. And then I will do a random drawing of those people who did put the symbol or the word in their comments. So if you put the symbol or the word, I'll know you want to participate in the drawing. That's easy enough. Okay, so that's everything, guys. I hope everybody is having a wonderful day. Remember, always be a dragon. Always. You can be anything in this world, so be a dragon. Spread your wings. Protect those you love. Have fiery passion. Stay strong, slay your fears, and always, always fly high, rise up, and soar. All right, everyone. Thanks for hanging out with me for a while. Thank you to all my new subs and all my True Blue subs. I'm really thankful for each and every one of you, and thanks for pushing me over the 500 mark, you guys. Bless your little hearts. I just adore all of you. I hope you enjoyed the unboxing today. I do still have a GBFKE order coming I also have a Raven Diamond Art canvas that I will be unboxing for you. And we will just keep going, you guys. All right. Have a wonderful day, and I will see you in the next one. Bye-bye.